What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Leaf Green walkthrough. Okay. How are you guys doing out there? Feeling good? Feeling great? That kind of stuff? I don't even know. I'm feeling great. I really am. I'm feeling damn good. So anywho, in our last episode, we defeated everybody in the, the SSN. Took about an hour just to do that, and uh, now it's time to do the impossible. Actually, I'm just playing, guys. This is the first time I'm ever going to do this. Yes, we're going to be battling for two gym badges in one episode. Why? Because uh, I kind of want to, you know, finish this whole thing. Give you guys a nice walkthrough, you know. Something that I've never done. So, anywho, let's go back up to Cerulean City. Because all my Pokemon are nice and leveled right here. And, uh, you know, feeling uh, confident that I can beat them all. I do have Sir Razor and Aaliyah to kick some boot. You know, some booty, booty, booty. And uh, here we go. The Underground Path going down and well I'm not really trying to get anything out, out of this but I'm still trying to get something Anywho, let's go right here and uh, before we do anything let's go ahead and take a look at or just check on our good old buddy Hydra see how many levels it's grown since you know we put him into the daycare so let's go back down right here uh, before we do anything let's go ahead and use a repel because uh, <laughs> Yeah, don't want to get attacked by any Pokemon. And yes, I have been building up those repels with every money that I've, uh, I've gained. So here we go. Let's see what we got. Alright, so your Hydra is growing a lot. Yes, eh, quite a lot, I'd say. Let me see, it's grown by a 7. Aren't I great? You owe me $800 for the return of this Pokemon. Well, it's 8 levels plus, or 7 levels plus 5. So that's at level 12. I'm going to have to wait until, you know, later on right here. So, well, let's go ahead and go back up to Cerulean City. Now, remember, your Pokemon grows with the amount of steps that you take. So, as I'm doing this right now, yes, I'm, you know, level leveling up my Hydra. Now, before we go into the gym, we got to do a little something. We did get a bike voucher back in Vermilion City. Now, we can go right here and talk to this guy. And he's like, oh, that's a bike voucher. Okay, here you go. And we got ourselves a bicycle, which is always great, guys. And uh, thank you, coming back again sometime. So we didn't even have to buy a bike or anything like that. So that's very good, very awesome. Super, super duper duper. Okay, so let's see, the gym. Cerulean City, Pokemon Gym Leader, uh, Misty, the tomboyish mermaid. Okay, so it's a very good place. Alrighty, the only man that's ever believed in us is right here. Yo, champ in the making. Let me give you some advice. The leader, Misty, is a pro who uses water-type Pokemon. You can drain it all or drain all their water with grass-type Pokemon, or you might be uh, might use an electric-type Pokemon to zap them. Okay, and as always, Gary has defeated this gym. That asshole. Anywho, let's go ahead and start battling a few a few water-type Pokemon trainers right here. Let's start with this guy. Bring it. Splash! I'm first up. Let's do it. All right. Bring it. Freaking Speedo Torpedo Man right here. Swimmer Louise wants the battle, and he's coming out with his horsey. Okay. Let's see what we got. Okay. So let's go with the Thunder Shock. Oh yes. Thunder Shock will do it. It will make you faint. I will defeat you. <laughs> And, uh, well, he's coming out with a shelter, so I'm going to stick with, uh, with my Aaliyah right here. And, uh, well, let's go ahead and do this again. Thundershock. For the win. That's right. You see, my Pokemon are nice and leveled up. Maybe a little too leveled up, but, you know, it's for the best right here for my Pokemon. <laughs> for the Pokemon. I'm doing it for the Pokemon, and as you can see, this can't be. That's right. It can't be. Ha 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 ha. He got defeated Speedo Torpedo, and he, let's like, see what he has to say right here. Misty is a trainer who's going to keep improving. She won't listen to someone like you. <laughs> Whatever you say, Speedo Torpedo. I beg to differ. I beg to differ. Okay, so let's go right ahead and battle the next trainer right here, and uh, I believe this one has a Goldeen, so I'm going to go give uh, my Sir Razor a little bit of a chance right here, because, yeah, let's go. And here it is. What? You? I'm more, more than good enough for you. Misty won't have to be bothered. Okay, whatever you say. Ugh, why do all these, like, sub-trainers think they're good enough? Better than the gym leader. I don't know. I think they want to be gym leaders. They probably should be. So here we go. Sir Razor coming out. And here we go with the Vine Whip. Oh, yes. 
and uh, yeah, that really didn't take it out. And uh, just be aware of that water support, guys, because uh, it will lower any kind of fire types of uh, power. But luckily for me, I won't be using any fire type Pokemon right here. So there it is, guys. What now? Alrighty. Okay. So that was easy. That was very easy. <laughs> That's how it feels to fail. Alrighty. You see, you have to face trainers, you got good really are, yeah, 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 whatever. Okay. Anywho, here is our next match against Misty, and uh, what I'm trying to do right now is I'm trying to, like, look for the fire red version right here. Hold on, just a sec, guys. Ah, here we are. Anywho, let's start off with a uh, good old buddy, Aaliyah, because she's awesome. So here it is, guys. Hi, you're a new face. Only those trainers who have uh, a policy about Pokemon can turn pro. What is your approach when you uh, catch and train Pokemon? My policy is an all-out offensive with, or policy is an all-out offensive with Water-type Pokemon. Okay. So here it is, guys. The next gym battle. We've been waiting for this for quite a while. Let's go. Oh yes, I love the song. Let's go. Oh yeah, I'm getting fired up. Super saiyan up. Here we go, Mister or <laughs> Leader Misty would like to battle, and she's coming out with her Star You. And here comes Aaliyah. So here we go in the next screen, guys. Yes, this comes back. We are battling Gym Leader Misty right here, the uh, Cerulea City Gym Leader. And yes, in Leaf Green and yeah, Fire Red, she has the same Pokemon, both Star You and Star Me. Star You is at level 18, has Tackle, Harden, Recover, and Water Pulse. You gotta be aware of that Water Pulse attack because it will confuse you. And then Star Me, it is both a Water and Psychic type Pokemon. Fortunately for us, it doesn't have a Psychic type attack. It does have Rapid Spin, uh, Swift, Recover, and Water Pulse. Again, be aware of that Water Pulse. It is strong and it will confuse you. So going back right here, oh yes, let's do this! Thunder Shock! Oh yes, eat it, Star you. Oh, wow, it, it, it ate it, but it didn't faint, and it will try to harden. it. You will not defeat me. You will not defeat me right here, and uh, of course, Every gym leader likes to use uh, healing items just so it can, uh, you know, have a fighting chance. You know, give it a little bit of more of a, of a chance for its Pokemon. And then, yeah, it's not going to faint right now. So here we go, Thunder Shock. Oh yes, and that is how you defeat Star You. What now? And Aaliyah has grown to level. Level well, it hasn't grown to level yet. So here she's coming out with a Starmie. I'm gonna go straight to Sir Razor because it does have much more of a special attack and. Uh, yeah, this Pokemon right here is going to be a little bit of a tough cookie for us. So here it is, Starmie, level 21. Bring it on with Vine Whip. And it does have Swift, so it will never miss an attack right there. So here we go, Vine Whip. That's right, super effective. And Bullet Seed. Oh, crud. The Swift attack is going to hit us pretty hard. So here we go, Bullet Seed for the win. There we go. Oh, yes. And that's how you defeat a Starmie. What now? What now? Alrighty. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. So we get a lot of experience points. Sir Razor grows to level 22. And I am the champion of the world. No, not really. I'm just right here. Wow, you're too much. Alright. You can have the Cascade Badge to show you beat me. Alrighty. That's right, Cascade Badge. And let's see. The Cascade Badge makes all Pokemon up to level 30 obey. That even includes outsiders you got in trades. There's more. Now you can use the cut technique anytime, even outside of battle. You can cut down small trees to open new pathways. You can also use, uh, or you can also have my favorite TM, which is TMO3. And that that move is Water Pulse. Very good move. Use it on aquatic Pokemon. Okay. And uh, she's just gonna continue telling us that. Okay. So that's another badge right there, guys. We are feeling victorious, awesome, and all that stuff. You beat Misty! See what I tell you! You and me, kid, we make a pretty good darn or darn good team. Yeah, you really didn't tell me that much. I'm, yeah, you can co tell my, my winnings and whatever. I don't care. Okay, so next is next. Uh, we have to go straight to Vermilion City, so I'm gonna do this. Let's see. TM case, and uh, let's use the HM01. And we got three Pokemon that can use that move. I actually thought Pig Hammer can use it. Crud. Okay, um... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go with Razor right now. It's only logical. And, uh, let's see. 
What moves should it use? Or should it... Yeah, oh crud. Okay. So, you know what? Poison powder. Don't really need it right now. Eventually I'll cut, or I'll, I'll switch it out for, uh... I'll switch it, I'll switch cut out for another move. I think we have a, room, a move reminder right here. But I do need that para, para, or paralysis uh, move, or whatever. Stun spore, just to... What was it? Yeah, stun spore. Yeah, we do need that stun spore just to uh, capture some legendaries and some easy Pokemon. So now we can cut this whole thing apart. And look at that. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we don't need to talk talk to Hydra right now. I probably grew to level 8 or 9 or whatever. And uh, we're going to go back down to the underground pathway. And, uh, yes, I will trade you a Pokemon later on. But here we are in the underground pathway again. Feeling all awesome and everything. Strong as hell. And we got ourselves another gym badge. Wait, what am I doing? Right here. Okay, so here we go. And, uh, let's go move around, beat everybody. Feeling strong, feeling great. I am the champion of this world right here. And, uh, well... First and foremost, we need to heal our Pokemon, so I'll be right back, guys. Alrighty, guys, so we're back, and, uh, yeah, healed up our Pokemon, and we're, uh, like, we're, we're, we're in tip-top shape and all that stuff, however we like to say it. And now we're going to be cutting down this whole thing right here, Sir Razor, ripping that thing. And we're feeling great. Okay, so here's the next gym, Vermilion City Gym, the leader, Lieutenant Surge, the Lightning American, also known as Gaio from Street Fighter. And, uh, well, let's see. Here we are in the gym. And, of course, this gym right here is just a little confusing than others because it does, uh, well, it, it's actually one of the verse that introduces tricks and whatever. So, let's go ahead and talk to this guy. Yo, champ in the making. Lieutenant Surge has a nickname. People refer to him as the Lightning American. He's an expert on electric Pokemon, bird, water Pokemon, match poorly against electric type Pokemon. Beware of paralysis, too. Lieutenant Surge is very cautious. He's looked, he's locked himself in, so it won't be easy to get him, you know. What he means is, yeah, we got these uh, things right here where we actually have to find a key, and it's always been confusing for me just to find the freaking uh, key because it's always, you know, at the, late, the last spot that you, uh, you ever look for it. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to be using Thrasher and Godzilla for this one right here because I do have two Pokemon that are weak against them. And nope. Nope. Okay, so let's go ahead and battle this guy. Don't care what kind of Pokemon he has. I'm a lightweight, but I'm a, I'm good with electricity. That's why I joined this gym. Alrighty. Bring it. So, let's see what this guy has. He's probably going to come out with a... Yeah, he's coming out with his Voltorb. Alrighty. Voltorb, you're going to be easy to... Easy pick a dragon. So here we go, Mega Punch. Few things about electric type Pokemon. They are fast. Very, very fast, and they will cause a lot of paralysis. And uh, it's probably one of my uh, main pit peeves, you know, getting paralyzed every single time. And look at that, got paralyzed! Ugh, God, I hate you. Make sure to bring a lot of paralysis, though. You got to, guys. And, uh, yeah. Alrighty. Coming out with the Magnemite. I'm going to stay with Godzilla, Godzilla. Because he will help me. And uh, Amber Attack. Come on. Come on. Ah, crud. Okay. Okay. Come on. Thundershock. Here we go. Oh, God. Godzilla, you're getting your butt kicked right now. And, uh, yes! Alrighty. Thank God for Steel-type Pokemon. Right, guys? And, uh, look at that. Engineer Bailey has been defeated. He's been fried. Fried chicken. Mm, fried chicken. Alrighty. Get that. Nothing right there. Um, okay, so the next Pokemon trainer right here will be using some Pikachus. So let's go ahead and switch out to our good old buddy Thrasher. And uh, well, let's grab this. Ah, here we go. That's one. And uh, I'm probably going to get this wrong. As you can see, messed up. And uh, we're messing up again. Alrighty. God dang it. I hate this gym. I really do. Alrighty, let's see, right here, no, here, no, here, no, and uh, right here, no, it's always at the last spot that you can see it, right here, okay, oh god, I hate these puzzles and all that stuff, right here, okay, well, maximum effort, let's go, this is no place for kids, not even if you're good, okay, 
Whatever you say, homeboy. So here we go. Going up against Sailor Dwayne. Coming out with his Pikachu. Alright. You got nothing on me. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Rock to. Oh, yes. That's right. You know, I could have taught... I could have taught Thrasher the gig, but I really didn't feel like giving it to him because, you know, it is a ground type Pokemon. That's, you know, that's more, you know, that's something more than, than I need. You know, it's it's a brutality. It's brute force will actually get me by right here. And uh, as you can see, Pikachu's getting its butt kicked. Slam. Let's go with another Rock Tomb. Does not work. Good God. And, uh, well, now this Pikachu's making it a little bit more difficult for me. To defeat it, so let's go right ahead and uh, go with Thrash. Okay, see what you're doing. And I missed! God dang it! Okay, here we go. Thrash again. Hey, it's Pikachu. You think you're so tough, okay? I see what you're doing. Here we go. And wow. See, this is what happens when you get a little too cocky. Just a little too cocky. So he's, you know, hitting me with everything he's got. And look at that Thrash attack. Does it sting? Eat it, Pikachu. God dang it! Paralysis. You gotta love that. Has to love the paralysis, guys. Okay, that's two Pokemon that got paralyzed. Oh, God. Okay, so... Yep, surprised you. Alright, so that's two down. Let's see what we got. Nope. 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 There it is. And... Uh, probably right here. Yes! Got it right! Ha ha ha! Okay, so no more of that. Let's see how many paralysis heals I have. Uh, crap. Ah, crap. Okay, so... <laughs> I was ill-prepared. Let the... I'll be right back, guys. Let me just uh, go ahead and buy a few more paralysis heals because, uh, yeah. Draven forgot to buy a paralysis heal. I'll be right back, guys. Twelve seconds later. Alrighty, guys. So I'm back right here, and I already healed up my Pokemon. Uh, didn't really go to the Pokemon Center. I just, you know, healed them. Use the paralysis uh, heals, and uh, now we gotta battle one more guy before we battle. Uh, what's his face? Uh, yeah, Lieutenant Surge, and uh, he does have one Pokemon. So I'm going to switch him up right here. Give it some uh, breathing room right here. So here we go. Bring it. When I was in the army, Lieutenant Surge was my Strixio. He was a hard taskmaster. Yeah, he should. So she. So he should. So here we go, guys, battling Gentleman Tucker, and he will be coming out with his Pikachu, and, uh, well, Pikachu versus Godzilla. Who would win this match? Find out. Ember attack, and this guy is coming out with his, oh, uh, God, you gotta love his, uh, double team attack. Alrighty, that's right, no double team attack will defeat me right here, and he's going with a, sla with a slam, but here we go, another double team, and that's how you defeat a Pikachu because it's weak on defense. <laughs> Look at that, level 24 Godzilla. Alrighty. Alrighty, okay. Okay, this Pikachu is nothing. He's like, stop! You're very good. Yes, I am. I'm very good. And he could talk to them and says, it's not easy opening that door. Lieutenant Surge was always famous for his cautious nature in an army. So he was. Okay, so let's see. Use that. And don't really need to see that. And uh, there we go. Godzilla is looking pretty awesome right there. And here we go for our next gym battle against Guile of Street Fighter. Hey, kid. What do you think you're doing here? You won't live long in combat. Not with your puny power. Tell me you, or I tell you, kid. Electric Pokemon saved me during the war. They zap my enemies into paralysis. The same as I'll do to you. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he wouldn't laugh like that, but you know what I mean. He, he's got himself a, a nice trio of Pokemon right here. So, here it is, guys. We're going to be battling Guile of Street Fighter. Let's go! Second gym battle. Dun, dun, dun. Gonna kick your ass. Here we go. Leaders, Lieutenant Surge coming out with his Voltorb, and I'm coming out with a Godzilla. All right. Second time for the screen right here. And as you can see, Lieutenant Surge... He is an electric type gym leader, and uh, he does have three Pokemon, Voltorb being one of them. Pikachu at the second uh, the second stage, and then he's got himself a Raichu. Now, Voltorb right here does have Soundproof as his ability. Shockwave, Tackle, Screech, and Sonic Boom. Remember, Sonic Boom automatically takes 20 HP, and at this point, yeah, that's bad. 
And uh, as you can see, the next one is Pikachu. He does have Shockwave, Thunder Wave, Quick Attack, and Double Team, so it'll try and screw with you with, it, with its evasiveness and paralysis. And then the last Pokemon right here, Raichu at level 24, does have Shockwave, Thunder Wave, Quick Attack, and Double Team, just like the Pikachu. Again, ground type Pokemon, grass type Pokemon, those are some of the best Pokemon. Don't forget rock types too. So here we go, back into the battle right here. Let's go, Mega Punch. And uh, yeah, I completely forgot about the whole speed thing. Oh, crud. So here we go. Mega Punch misses. Come on. Let's go. And uh, did I forget? Shockwave does not miss at all, guys. So we're going to be uh, we're gonna be in troll right here. We're trying to just beat this guy with, like, regular-ass Pokemon. And as you can see, there's that Sonic Boom. So already I'm just at 20 H H uh, 28 HP right here. And, uh, well, that was an easy victory for us. So I'm going to go up against this Pikachu and then uh, take care of Raichu later on. So here we go, Ember Attack, finish him off. Oh crud, oh crud, and uh, as you can see, Paralysis is one of the big things right here. So let's go again, and of course, it likes to use Double Team because it doesn't like being hit, especially with Pikachu. Yeah, we already know, very, very weak defense is like right now. Suck it, Pikachu. All right. And here he comes out with his last Pokemon, Raichu. I'm not going to risk it, so let's go with Thrasher right here. Oh yes, Thrasher. The ground-type Pokemon. And, uh, well, this Raichu right here is looking big, plumpy, and strong. So, let's go, Rock Tomb. And, uh, crud. Yeah, that's one thing that I didn't, I, I didn't want to happening. Now, I'm gonna have to go all physical on this guy. I'm gonna go all Jack Daniels on him, and crud, he's... Oh, damn. He knows that we got a... Oh, God. We got a Pokemon that can beat him easily. Come on, Thrasher. Oh, damn. God damn. So it's gonna be damn near impossible to hit this guy. Oh, God. Come on, Thrasher. There we go. Oh, yes. Takes half its HP. You're gonna get poisoned. Ha, 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 ha. There's no need for me to hit you anymore. You're gonna beat yourself up, and look at that. And that is how you win a battle, guys. <laughs> Thrasher with the victory. Lieutenant Surge, he's like, now that's a shocker. You're the real deal, kid. Fine. Take this Thunder Badge. Okay, all right. All right, we're getting that Thunder Badge right there. So he's like, the Thunder Badge cranks up your Pokemon speed. It also lets your Pokemon fly lightning quick to any time, kid. You're special, kid. Take this. We get the TM-34. We all know what move that is. It's Shockwave. Teach it to an electric Pokemon. Alrighty. Okay. Alright. A little word of advice, kid. Electricity is sure par powerful, but it's useless against ground-type Pokemon. Okay, well. Thanks for the tips. Um, uh, I'll be cheering for you once you take on Ryu and Ken, so that's, that's the kind of thing right there. Sorry, Ryu, my bad guys. So talk to this guy right here, and let's see what he says. Whoa, that was... That match was electric! Yes, it was. Okay, alrighty guys, so that is another victory for us right there. Three badges total. We've accomplished what we needed to do, and uh, now we got the ability to cut anything in sight. So, what we're going to do is we're going to just pause right here. And uh, in the next episode, we will be doing a small side quest. You know, just to, yeah, just to take you guys' mind off of things, you know. A lot of busy stuff that we had to do. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.